Sheikh Dr. Muhammad Alisa, it is my great honor to present you the 2022 America Abroad Media Award. It gives me the chance to practice what my tradition calls Hakarat Hatov, expressing gratitude. In this case, gratitude for your unique leadership and remarkable contributions to our world. This recognition is incredibly appropriate, Dr. Alisa, because few public figures have channeled the transformative power of storytelling the way that you have in your role as Secretary General of the Muslim World League. During my time in Congress, I followed the narrative that you were shaping. I was impressed by your unwavering voice against religious extremism in all of its manifestations. I heard about a man of great character who lent his own courage and platform to Muslim scholars from across the world to amplify their support for interreligious cooperation and shared human society. Now, as CEO of AJC, American Jewish Committee, I have the privilege of stewarding your ongoing relationship with our organization. Your relationship with AJC is a friendship, but it could also be characterized as one of telling new stories and telling the stories that we share in new places and in new ways. When together with AJC, you led a Muslim Jewish mission to Auschwitz, you helped to shine a light on one of the darkest periods in human history, the Holocaust. You helped the Arab and Muslim worlds learn the universal lessons about the consequences of hate, but you also emphasized anti-Semitism and the devastation that it wrought for Jews. When you spoke at HAC's Global Forum, you highlighted the scourge of anti-Muslim bigotry and the shared values between Judaism and Islam. Your campaign to correct misrepresentations of Muslims and Islam in entertainment and on social media has resonated so deeply within me and within all of us at AJC. If we allow the culture that is broadcast into our homes, our screens, and our minds to portray Muslims as extremists and as outsiders, we are allowing the dehumanization to occur on our watch. This is simply wrong, and as Jews, we know too well that hate is like wildfire. It spreads, and it spreads, and it spreads, and know that we are your partners in stopping hate from spreading. Dr. Alisa, AJC, and all of us here tonight are partners in your mission to help humanity tell a new story, one in which each person gets to explain themselves in their own terms, in which our particularities actually help us foster compassion for those who are different from us, and in which our religious communities cooperate for the good of all. Dr. Alisa, I thank you for your leadership. I congratulate you on your recognition tonight, and I look forward to seeing you soon.